Hello friends, today I am going to explain about themed app icons introduced in Android 13. With this feature, app icons in supported Android launchers are tinted to inherit the colouring of the user's chosen wallpaper and other themes. The first step of implementing the themed icons feature is to make sure that your application is already using an adaptive icon as its main icon asset. I have already explained about this adaptive icons in my last video. So please go through this video before implementing themed icons. I will give the link in the description box for your reference. So if you rewind about the adaptive icons, these adaptive icons support a variety of masks which vary from one device to another. And also this adaptive icon supports a variety of visual effects which display when users place or move the icon around the home screen. How to test these visual effects I already showed you in my last video. So while designing the adaptive icon, the main important point to be considered is the size of your app logo or icon displayed in the foreground layer. Consider the background layer size is 108 by 108, then you need to design your app logo in 72 by 72 size in the center, which is a safe zone. For example, take WhatsApp app icon. This is foreground layer and this is background layer. So both together make adaptive icon. If you design your app icon in 512 by 512 size, make sure your app logo in the center should not exceed 340 by 340 dp size. Okay, now you understood the concept of adaptive icon. Let's come back to the themed app icons. Hello friends, welcome back to Ireka Tech Solutions. To support the themed app icon, you need to provide the single layer that is only foreground layer for the monochromatic version of the icon. Monochromatic means containing or using only one color. So even if your icon has more than one color, you need to change your icon to have only one color to support for themed app icon. And there are some more requirements you need to consider while creating the monochromatic asset. Those are all layers must be sized at 108 by 108. The icon should be clean edges. The layers must not have masks or background shadows around the outline of the icon. The logo must be at least 48 by 48 dp. It must not exceed 72 by 72 dp because the inner 72 by 72 dp of the icon appears within the masked viewport. The outer 18 dp on each of the four sides of the layers are reserved for masking and to create visual effects such as parallax or pulsing. So, considering these design requirements, let's start creating monochromatic icon for our app. Okay, before creating the monochromatic icon, first let's see how does our app look like when the themed icons option is applied on the Android 13 device. Drag the app to home screen, go to settings, come down, click on this wallpaper and style option, enable themed icon support. Now go back to home screen. See some apps are changed to themed icon format and some are including my app not changed the icon which is not supporting the monochromatic version of the icon. Okay, now let's design the icon. Go to Adobe XD. I already designed my app icon in this software only. See this is my app icon. If you have designed the icon by using only the shapes and patterns, then if you just change the color of the icon, you are good to go. But here in my app icon, I use some external images also. So I will have to design the monochromatic icon freshly again. So let's start. Create the artboard and change the size to 108 by 108. The outline of the app logo should not change. So while designing this app icon, you need to consider all those requirements explained in the developer page. So the actual logo should not exceed 72 by 72 dimensions. And you should use only one color that is black. And adjust the shapes to create monochromatic version of your uh, app icon. Here I am showing this icon creation on 8x speed. If you face any difficulty on using this software, uh, you will get uh, many videos on using this Adobe XD to design the icons, so you can refer them.
okay at the end remove the artboard color it has to be transparent to apply device theme effect once everything is done go to file export selected and give the name as ic underscore launcher underscore monochrome and save Now copy this image into the resource drawable folder of your project and open the ic underscore launcher dot xml in mipmap any dpi folder. Here add a new element for monochrome icon and if you are supporting different icon asset for circular mass then you need to add this uh, property in ic launcher round dot xml file also. Okay, everything is done. Now run the app. See the icon changed to themed icon. Okay, now go to settings, wallpapers and style, enable dark theme. See the icon changes accordingly. Let's change the theme colors here. See your app gets new themed icon. Okay, let's change the wallpaper and see. Try out some new wallpapers. You can observe your app icon changes for theme effects. So this way you can implement a themed app icon in your Android projects. But if the home screen does not display the themed app icon for your app means these three scenarios might have occurred. The first one is the user has not enabled themed app icons in the settings of the Android device. Remember this is introduced in Android version 13. Second one your app does not provide a monochromatic app icon. Third one, the launcher does not support themed app icons. In above scenarios, your app icon does not change to themed app icon. Hope you understood the concept of themed app icon by watching this video. If you think this video is helpful, please like, comment and subscribe to iRecaTech Solutions. Thank you.